So to start off, we're going to create the text we want to add the animated neon effect to. Go over and click on the Type tool, and then click on your preview window, and type in the text that you want. Now you'll want to go over to the Essential Graphics panel. If for some reason you don't see it, you can activate it by going to the Window tab and selecting it from the drop-down menu. With our new text layer highlighted on the timeline, go over to the Essential Graphics panel, and under Edit, click on your Word, which will open up some options. Here you can do things like center the text, or change the size and color, or even change the font of your text. When you're happy with how it looks, go down and check off the shadow option and change it to a neon color of your choice. Then go down to your timeline and duplicate the text layer by holding Alt and clicking and dragging above. Now we want to add Gaussian Blur to our duplicated text layer. Go over to Effects and type in Gaussian Blur and add it to the top text layer we just duplicated. Under Effect Controls, go down and change the blend mode to Screen, and then starting from the beginning of our timeline, go and click on the stopwatch icon under Blurriness. This will add a keyframe. Now move ahead one second and change the blurriness to 120. Then move ahead another second and change the value back down to 40. Continue doing this, alternating between 40 and 120 blurriness every second for as long as you want your effect to last. Now you have a nice looking animated neon text effect for your videos.